while you're teaching a class you may well have small amounts of data that you want to put in to the um, let's see, 11 that you want to put into a document and you don't want to go back to your keyboard to do it you don't want to interrupt the flow of the lesson so one option is to always have an on-screen keyboard sitting on your taskbar now it can be pinned if you've not needed it for a while here it is pinned to my taskbar and I can open it I can then click on the cell or wherever I need to type and I can use my keyboard at the screen and there my graph is building up another situation where you may want it you may well have students working on some website this is Khan Academy it's a straightforward answer I think you'd see that's 50 percent so we can just add that in and students can check their answer now let's suppose this keyboard is closed and let's suppose we didn't have it pinned to our taskbar how would we get it back and I'm going to go over I'll be at the keyboard now because we only have to do this once uh, keyboard this is the Microsoft keyboard now if you are using smart notebook their keyboard is much smaller and you may want to use that once I've got the keyboard on the screen I'm going to pin it to the taskbar that way if I close it and I want it again in three or four weeks time I can just click once here on the taskbar and it's there for me um, all applications that you use regularly can be pinned to the taskbar or unpinned just as we've done now.